call goes simply because when I was a kid growing up, one night when they didn't have any electricity in my challenges, um, I came down in all white, white shirt, white pants, and someone said, like, where that ghost coming from? And ever since that name, I've stuck. I have to give back. Um, I, I, I thought that I have had, had a tremendous life, which derived from basketball. Um, I got a basketball, a four-year basketball scholarship, and now I'm back home. I think that is my duty to give back to society. Plus, there's some ills that I've seen around that I think I could definitely make a positive contribution. My strength is that I think that persons will see a genuine, a genuine person who needs to address the needs of the constituents, and not just my constituents in constituency four, but the persons um, living on this island. They must know that Glenn Phillip will represent them at the highest level, and I will do so with no fear of contradiction. The Labour ticket uh, represent, pr represents program that I'm definitely interested in. I'm interested in some of the um, initiatives that they have ongoing, and so I think I can add to what they're um, proposing at this point in time. Right now, I'm proposing persons who have been through high school, sixth form colleges, to join me, and join me for us to have after-school programs where we can assist the kids in computer learning. Crime is dear to my heart. Um, I have lost friends. There's definitely another way, and we have to pursue that other way vigorously to keep our kids, not only our kids, but the people in our community safe. We're focusing too much on a band-aid. The schools should be more proactive. Not only the school, our neighbors, our church, for moral support. We, 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 we count on the church and we count on the police, the teachers. Everyone has to have a hand in this problem. What we do sometimes is that we compare our, our, our past, which means our youth, to the kids of today. And I think there's a disconnect and we turn them off completely. But we have to understand where the youths are coming from and then we can build programs to really curtail crime. I have met a guy about seven years old and what he told me is the fact that um, no one is looking for the kids between three years to ten years old. They need recreation grounds for them to go out and play with their parents after school um, instead of going in front of TV because it's not only a, as a sport, it helps them in terms of being healthy and um, to curtail some of the illnesses that are around, for example, diabetes, etc. There's no proper netball facility in my area and there are countless young ladies who are very, who are very interested in uh, pursuing this sport, not just from the community level, but at the national level. In terms of creating jobs for our constituency, at this point in time I've met um, several persons who want land, lands for farming, agriculture. I think this is very important, especially with this global crisis that we are facing, that we can produce, our, that they can produce our own food, or we have the ability to feed our own people. We have uh, one of the better fishing complexes, uh, fisheries in Old Road, um, that will that was completed, I think, two years ago. We can expound on that. We have to, we have to promote um, entrepreneurship. This helps to build um, our economy. Uh, if I had to take on Obama in basketball, I'd beat him, definitely. Um, I think he's too light. When I say too light, he's, I don't think anyone who's skinnier than I am and older than I am can beat me.